like a girl. Linda Labonte has been breeding and training dogs for over two decades. <laughs> and she knows the difference between violent aggression and just acting out. This looks like these dogs are extremely aggressive and about to rip me apart. What's really happening here? Right now, they're just barking and saying hi, everybody. And Linda says the average pit bull bred for dog fighting is almost impossible to rehabilitate. Pit bulls, when they're trained the way they are, you can't bring them back. I've seen some turn around, but there again, you got to have the time. And that's what a group of dog lovers is hoping to do. They want to change the state law to allow pit bulls rescued from dog fighting operations to be evaluated to see if they can be saved. They're being rescued um, so that they can be euthanized. Sheila Carlisle owns Phantom, one of the few pit bulls who's been rehabilitated. Because they're assumed to be dangerous animals and you see how dangerous this is a good boy right here. Currently, state law requires any canine involved in dog fighting operations to be deemed dangerous, and thus, they have to be destroyed. We really need um, the legislation to know that they need to be evaluated as individuals. They're dogs. They're not fighters. They're made to be fighters. 